This is a national emergency. I've decided to catalog all the theories about where the Z virus came from. There's more than a few. Is it what the Zoroastrians would call for shock already? Or are we contaminated with Amazon brain rot? Or maybe we passed through the tail of a comet that sprinkled the Earth with zombie dust? Or was it a Defense Department weaponized virus that escaped the lab? Or how about self-fulfilling prophecy? Public fascination with all things zombie just willed it into existence. As things went south, the theories got weirder. Good times for religions with an end of the world scenario, the crazier the better. The apocalypse business was booming, at least while there was still business to boom. Reminds me of a poem by Yeats. And what rough beast, it's hour come round at last, slouches toward Bethlehem to be born. There is no cure. <laughs> what rough beasts indeed. Lab stat. Paul Sox is down to 78. I got a paralyzed blade and ET tube. I'm in. Whoa. What's happening? Why is he bleeding? Did you nick his trachea? No, no, it was an easy intubation. Ah, damn it. He's got diffused ronchite now. I need to sculpt him and see why he's bleeding. What's going on with those labs? I just got them. A couple of abnormals. ALT is 2,800, creatinine is 7, and INR is up to 11. He's in liver failure. That's why he's not clotting. His kidneys are shutting down, too. Yeah, I see a bleeding vessel. Give me the coagulation electrode so we can cauterize it. If you don't reverse liver failure, it's going to keep bleeding. Any idea what's going on? Not yet. There's only so many holes you can pass before the dam bursts. What about the track at the gym? Maybe she went for a run. Hold on. Are you okay? She's here. Please come home. 
I'll just assume that I'm grounded or whatever. Where have you been? I've been worried sick. I was at a party, okay? No, it's not okay. None of this is okay. And yes, you are definitely grounded, and there are going to be a lot of changes around here. I don't care if you're 18. Fantastic, more change. Taryn, talk to me. I'm fine. No, you are not. Yeah, well, it's senior year. I mean, everything's supposed to be different. I know. But you seem different. Talk to me. I'm listening. Please. You can tell me. It'll be okay. Whatever it is, it'll be okay. Everyone's mad at me, and they're right, and then I try to change things, and nothing's working. Well, you're, you're 18, and you're barely 18. You're not supposed to have everything all figured out. But you make it seem like I have to. Will you come sit down with me? Darren, please come and sit down. After your dad died, I hated that you had to come home alone after school every day. I, I, I just couldn't stand. You were so young and you knew how to use a key and the microwave washing machine. And when Will and I got married and he offered to let me take a break from working, all that guilt went away and I was able to focus on you. <laughs> I guess I did that a little too much, huh? Well, I'm sorry that I told you that you needed to get alive. I get it. You need your own life, right? Things change, and since they do, they can change again. Oh, um, I had to coach beginner swim this afternoon, so. My hair got wet. So this is your real hair? This is it. Well, you look, you look just fine. Thanks, Dad. Um, okay, uh, where's, where's, where's my phone? Uh, you're holding it. Oh, right, um, I'm a little nervous. Sure, you're outside your comfort zone. Dorothy, wow. This is her real hair. Dad. Have her home by midnight. Yes, sir. A lot of hunting isn't just about shooting and killing things. Unfortunately, there are people in this world that do that and give hunting a bad name sometimes. But it is as much about being a part of nature. If you've never listened to the woods wake up in the morning, I strongly suggest you do it.
I made the mistake a few years ago of shooting a doe that was smaller than I thought she was. I was very disappointed and very upset. So I would rather let one walk and be sure of their size than um, take one that is too small.